Hello, hello, Dream Reaver 23 here, back for another episode of Minecraft. Now, if you saw my last episode, you know that I was pretty upset with how everything kind of worked out. Um, that was no fun whatsoever. But, I'm back at it again. Uh, I did manage, to, I put a one of the steam engines over here since I kind of used up my diamonds to, uh, go down spelunking and everything like that. Didn't expect to get knocked into the damn lava by a zombie, but what can you do? So I uh, got my quarry back going. I have it extended out a little bit so that it uh, kind of takes care of this little corner edge. <clears throat> so right now we need to get some more diamond going and some more quarries going and make more quarries and pretty much everything because I lost everything in the fire. The fire of me. Um, kind of get some of my recipes going. Uh, I run dual monitors, so that's why you never really see what I'm doing here on the other side. But uh, I run dual monitors. <clears throat> and uh, it's nice. I do enjoy having the dual monitor support. So yeah, dual 24 inch monitors turns out pretty nicely. Um, alright. What we got over here? It's not producing much yet just because I, I don't really have too much shit to go off of. I don't know, I could pull my diamonds out of, out of, uh, the different spots over here. But, um, I'm just gonna leave it how it is. We'll go through and, and do it kind of the hardcore way. Now I did get one more mod, and I'm gonna uh, show y'all uh, show y'all that here. Um, give me one second. I'm gonna make sure I have the recipe right for it. Doo -doo. And I done, I got this mod because uh, of what happened with my quarries. I was actually responding to a response back on. Uh, my channel and uh, kind of <laughs> wasn't paying attention to my uh, combustion engine and it blew up for lack of a better word that's about all I can say is it just blew up so <clears throat> well, this mod right here that I'm going to show you is a pretty spiffy one uh, it's the CCTV mod. It's closed caption television. So what you do with it is you set up and you lay out five iron ingots, three redstone, and a piece of glass, and you make a CCTV camera. And then let's see, we need to make a a screen for it so we can actually see what's going on and that's three iron ingots five glass and one redstone and you have the CCTV monitor now I did make uh, another thing earlier and, and the monitor so I can check to make sure the module is working and so my idea is I'm actually gonna have probably over here in this corner just a uh, monitoring room um, so I will show you how this mod works and we can actually kind of get one of the little areas set up over here uh, just for now so I can kind of show you how it works and everything like that so we can see that I have my steam engine over here which you do want to make sure doesn't you know overheat or anything like that let's set this up on a little stand so we're gonna place our uh, CCTV camera you pay it faces away from you so basically to get it there and with this one it is you know destroyable it doesn't you know deteriorate or anything like that so I can place it again if I don't have it set up right and say I wanted to put one at my front entrance right here just to watch to see what who's coming in and whatnot we can put it up and we'll actually put it up right here in the middle uh, this one's going to be kind of tricky. Ah, good deal. 
So, since I'm going to build this over here, I need some something. There, I got 40 cobblestone right here. Add this to my little pile. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. That'll be a good size. Let's close this off a little bit. I don't know if I'm going to have enough. Oh, damn, I'm probably not. I need some more. Let's do this like that. Still not gonna be enough for me. Tell you what, for right now, you go down to black. So that'll start sending some stuff this way. Actually, let me make this front area glass so I can kind of see in here. Do do do. Um. Yeah. Damn it! Now I'm gonna need more sand. Lights off. Are they off everywhere. No. What's going on over here? Oh, I know. I was getting some coal from here earlier, <laughs> so I can run my shit. I know I got some redstone wire in here. Two. That's all I need. some light. Alright. Make me a little door. <clears throat> I'm sure you guys do know that you always want to make sure you put your door on the outside so nobody can come in. Um, we will... What will we do? Let's take these off. And we'll remove this light right here. No, wrong one. I just put it right back there, didn't I? Hmm. And I'm going to be doing more stuff with the red wire. This is a uh, small piece of what this mod's going to be. All right.
Didn't plan on that happening. Isn't it V that you hit? Give me one sec, guys. Well, looks like I'm going to have to go and make me some more insulated wires. Actually, I can steal them from here because I ain't shit running on here yet. That's a better idea. Yeah. No, as I was saying, I am going to build more, uh, do a lot more with the red power mod just because it is a really damn cool mod and need another switch down here don't really need a switch but I like having a mess with switches on So got some light in here. Turn this, close this. He's gotta be on the outside, but it still makes me nervous. After losing all my shit. <laughs> Alright, so, got that set up, and with the CCTV mod, uh, so I grabbed the uh, CCTV monitor, and you can right click, you can make it different sizes, so right now we'll do this to where they're kind of a bigger size. Um, Ooh. Let's make it look a little bit fancy in here. Let's go to sleep before I get killed. Actually, we're not going to make it fancy yet because I want to do a few things. Because my eventual goal is I want to have it to where... Um, basically you have all your monitors and then they're going to be labeled over here and I'm going to have the red power that goes to all the different switches to like be able to turn on pumps to uh, get fuel or water over there um, to where they're controlled up here so I'm going to go ahead and place these that's too big let's get them placed right here and then we'll place another one right beside it so there is the front door <laughs> you can see outside or if you right click you can see or on this side or it goes to your game view you can have up to 13 different monitors going at once and then I can show you kind of some of the bigger sizes eh, dang it motherfucker little widescreen view So these come out, I believe they say they're at 128 by 128 pixels. So I could set that closer in if I wanted to. And go for the biggest one. Ah, dang it, I did it again. Now the bigger they go, the darker they seem to get. Whenever they're smaller, they're a lot better. I like them being smaller there, a bit brighter, and they do stick out from the wall a little bit, so. Pretty cool little mod. I'm uh, <laughs> really liking it, so I can actually set up my quarries and keep an eye on my engines, maybe have them labeled underneath. 
So since I can do up to 13 different monitors, I can have it to where they, uh, I can keep an eye on all my stuff. Keep one on the front, you know, whatever I want to do. So I can still see that that one's blue. It's pixelated, it kind of still has the same aesthetic and feel. And it looks like there's a creeper back over there in the corner. I bet you that's what it is over there. And so that will be my control center, my monitor room. <clears throat> so I hope you guys like that little part. I think it's pretty neat. Why am I running at such a low FPS? And where the fuck did you come from, creeper? Let me see if that changes. I'm running right now at about 20 frames a second. Wow, that is what it is. Now I'm back up to around 40. You should be friendly, but you're going to die anyways. So yeah, that does affect my frames per second with that mod. I don't know what it is that makes it do with that. It shouldn't really be affected. But we'll get all that figured out here in a bit. And right now I'm going to actually move this camera in a bit closer so I can see a better view of this right here. When you have multiple cores and stuff like that, it definitely seems like you do need to have this system set up. But right now, mine's kind of premature again, just for the fact that my quarry blew up. Alright, gonna test this bad boy again. Maybe it's just this room? Running about 30 frames a second, 35 frames a second. Make sure I don't got a bunch of other stuff going through and eating up system resources. Let's exit out of that. Exit out of you. Exit out of there. Close that. Exit. And all right. Okay. Yeah, I don't know what was going on with that. And then as soon as I place it, what happens? rate drops down. So yeah, that definitely affects frame rate right there. I don't know why it affects it, especially whenever I go to other areas. So this is coming across right now at about 20 frames a second. See, and right now it shouldn't be even in a viewable area. turn these on and off. That'd be pretty cool. Nope. 
And so you could keep one of these with you so at all times you can monitor your stuff. And that's a pretty big one. Oh, ran out of fuel. All right. So for right now, guys, that's all I'm going to show you on this one. I want to see how this one uploads and how it looks whenever I do get it. Uh, watch the video uh, since I'm seeing that the frame rate's dropping and everything like that. So I'm going to see if I can do something to adjust the settings as well. And motherfucker. get that bottom down there taken care of all right guys so i will see you on the next video so that is a view of the cctv mod um pretty cool mod and i'm gonna have a lot of fun with it so i will talk to you guys next time i'm gonna check this video and get it uploaded thanks guys